Abuse. What is abuse? Is it an action or is it a mind game? What's that on my plate? Just a shit. I thought I told you I was going to be home by half past five. Where were you? I'm just at my friend's house. What friend? I told you time and time again not to go around it. Yet again, you were too busy to get my dinner ready for when I get home. She's a troublemaker and a nosy bitch at that. Oh, friend, friend. When are you ever gonna learn that you, you don't need any more friends? You've got me and that's all you ever need. Is a mother someone who protects her children from life's battles? Because if that's the case, then yes, my mother was a good one. Parenting was something that was thrown upon me from a young age. Mother was never really there for Polly. I had to make sure her hair was brushed and she was dressed and fed properly. I'm sure mother cared for Polly, but dad was too demanding of her time by this point. What's this stain on my shirt? No, I'll get it out. I'm trying to damage one. Ah! Tim! No, please, Tim, no, please. No. Tim! No, Tim! No. Ah! Ah! Tim! Or is a mother someone who stays with someone who is constantly threatening towards them and can clearly do no right in the relationship? Because if that's the case, then I had the worst mother to date. Despite mother's best attempts of covering up, I could see the truth behind her fake smile. Linda! Do you have it? I didn't, honestly, I didn't. Stop lying to me. All you do is lie, lie, lie. You're a pro at it. When are you ever going to learn that you'll never get with anyone better than me? Stop lying. All you do is lie. No, What do you mean? You know I've just come from work. Well, it's alright for some. I'm sorry? I've been here all day looking after your son, whilst you get to go out and have time for you. What about me? But I'm doing my best to provide for you and George. Doing your best? That's what my dad used to say, that he was just doing his best. Doing his best to destroy our lives, more like. Yes, but I am not your dad. I'm nothing like him. Here. 
Who are you texting? Um, just someone from work. Well, that someone's a she. And she's texting a married man. Sarah, relax, okay? She's a work colleague and we're discussing a meeting for tomorrow. Tony, can't make it. No, I'm not telling her that. Well, if you've got nothing to hide. Look, I've got nothing to hide. I'm not that sort of person that messages other women like that. You're overreacting. You think that all men are like your dad. Well, we're not. Overreacting. You've got me, and that's all you ever need. We just pretend to love you. <laughs> it's okay. I can't be like him. I don't want to be like him. Sarah! Sarah! Look what you've done to our son! I almost lost everything and everyone that meant something to me. But then I realised, you can't change your past, but you can change your future.